Assalamu alaikum. Today I want to talk to you about the number 19. In particular, the 19 angels that are the guardians of hell. Uh, what happens is Muslims get to a certain surah and a certain ayat, which is surah 74, ayat 31, and they begin to have questions like the number 19, how are numbers significant? Who are these 19 angels that are the guardians of hell? So today I'm going to give you the names of the 19 angels that are the guardians of hell so that you can be well informed. Uh, so Surah 74, Ayah 31 says this, And we have set numbered angels as guardians of the fire, and we have fixed their number 19 only as a trial for the disbelievers in order that the people of the scripture, Jews and Christians, may arrive at certainty that this Quran is the truth as it agrees with their books regarding number the number 19, which is written in the Torah and the Injil. And that the believers may increase in faith as the Quran is the truth, and that no doubt may be left for the people of the scripture and the believers, and that those in whose hearts is a disease of hypocrisy and the disbelievers may say, What Allah intends by this curious example? Thus Allah leads astray whom he wills and guides whom he wills, and none can know the host of your Lord but he, and this hell is nothing else than a warning reminder to mankind. Now, the Injil is what Muslims call the Gospel, and the Torah is what Muslims call the Torah. So, the name of the 19 angels are Yusuf, Christ, Gabriel, Michael, Satan, Apollyon, Azazel, Saul, Moroni, Uriel, Hurat, Morat, Upran, Lucifer, Apennatus, Idris, Dulcornain, al Qadr and Arush. On that note, I'd like to say assalamu alaikum.